Full time between Wexford and Athlone Town and Wexford have their first win of the season with a 3-0 win over a perfect Athlone so far in the season. Had six points from six, but Wexford giving them the first loss of the season with that win tonight. Uh, just six minutes in, it could have been very different, I suppose. Isaiah Louis hit the post for Athlone, and Minogue down the other end, caught a Reese Webb cross. Athlone went right up the pitch. Ball found its way to Louis on the right-hand side and he smacked the post. Uh, Wexford would heed the warning, however, just five minutes later. Aaron Robinson went on a nice run down the left-hand side. He laid it off for Han Ratty, who swung it in, and Aaron Dobbs rose highest and found the net. Uh, Wexford would just go on from that stage, and in the 35th minute, I think that a clear penalty waved away. Dobbs had played in behind the Athlone defence, and just as he was bearing down on goal, he was nudged in the back by Noah Van Geenen. Last man looked like a clear penalty. Could have been a sending off as well, but the ref waved away any protests. Um, Wexford were infuriated a minute later when Athlone won a free for a very similar foul in the middle of the pitch, but thankfully this moment wouldn't decide the game. Uh, they had their lead doubled in the 50th minute when Aaron Robinson found the back of the net. Uh, Aaron Connolly fouled Dobbs on the left-hand side and Hanratty got the free. He swung it in. Minogue went to punch clear, but just didn't punch it clear enough. Uh, Robinson was waiting on the edge of the area. He looped it over everybody in his wake, found the back of the net, made it 2-0. And he compounded what was a really good performance in the 60th minute when the ball was laid off to him just outside the box. He found the top corner with what was an absolutely superb strike. And with that, uh, the cake had its icing. So full time in Ferry Carrick Park between Wexford and Athlone. And it's Wexford 3, Athlone nil.